guys, Mystical here from the Lava Pool MC, and I've started a survival world that we're going to be making a series a series off of. It's plain vanilla, so let's get off to it. I think our goal for now is to get to the nether. I'm playing on normal difficulty. If you were <coughs> I was playing on normal difficulty if you were wondering. But here, let's get some wood. Sorry that our uploads have been off a little bit, but we're trying to get into the swing of things with school starting and all. But hopefully eventually we'll get back on track. Okay, so now that I've got some wood, okay, I'll kill another chicken if I can get to him. Or he can evade me forever. There we go. Finally. Okay, so let's make some wood. What I usually like to do is I make a crafting table and then just make a pickaxe and then mine some stone. So let's go ahead and do that right now. some stone and make a full set of tools. Then we'll probably work on building the house. So, okay, now we all need coal, some torches. Here we go. That should be enough cobblestone. make our tools now. Hopefully that's enough for like for a full set of tools and a yep, too short. Oh let's get a couple extra just to make sure we don't run out or anything. There we go. Okay, so we got our full set of tools. Now I'm going to arrange my inventory because it bothers me it bothers me a lot if I don't have my inventory arranged for some reason I like it a certain way and that's the way I like it and if it's not how I want how I like it I get kind of confused there we go fill up our map pick up our crafting table oh I thought this was a bigger cave there was a cave over here when I spawned. We'll go to that one in a second. Gotta get some cobblestone. Oh, and some sugar cane. I might as well pick up some sand while I'm over here. That way if I never need ever need sand for like glass or something, I'll have it. Okay, but now let's go explore that cave over here. Well, I guess it's not really a cave, is it? Well, I'll probably I'll need some more wood. So I'll go get some. After I kill that chicken. <coughs> there we go. Missed that piece. There we go. Oh, I found a sheep. Hi, Mr. Sheep. You're gonna die. His wool was not soft enough and thick enough to protrude my sword away from his body. I have no clue if I just made that word up, but. I'm, if it's a real word, I'm pretty sure I misused it. But let's go try to find a actual cave and more animals. And I'll need to make a furnace. Well, I've made a furnace. And yeah, I made a furnace. 
I'll just get some charcoal and stuff to cook my co cook my food. Well, let's get some uh, let's get some meat. Then we'll make some charcoal and cook my food. Okay, here we go. Get our furnace out. Set up a little base sort of thing over here. Might as well put it down there. There we go. Now it's out of the way. Put some wood in there. Maybe. There we go. Put some wood in there to make charcoal. Turn the rest into planks. We'll make some sticks. More tools later on. And torches. I'm going to get some more wood real quick. Then I can put it in my furnace to make into charcoal. That way, I'll have some torches and stuff to cook my food with. Now, let's make sure that it has fuel. Get my stuff cooked. Oh, I got a trophy. So after that's done cooking, I'll cook my food. And let us kill this cow. Okay, so when that's done cooking, we'll start adventuring again. Well, I finished cooking everything I wanted to cook, but it's the middle of the night now. So, yeah, we're going to have to survive. I'll probably focus on baking a house pretty soon. Actually, now I should probably do that. But the hard part I always have is what to make the house out of like what materials and what would look good because I never know what will look good because and I really like making good houses it bothers me if my house isn't very good if it's not good I eventually fix it but oh there's a lock there Lots of the time, it takes me a long time to build my house. So I'm thinking about just going to to a village and finding it for now, and then I could make like a, s and then I could make a house later on. But for now, I think it'd be a better idea to go try to find a try to find a village. But if I can't do that, I will just build a house. I've got quite a lot of cooked food now. Oh, actually, from those cows I killed, I'm gonna make a helmet with the leather I have. That way I have some sort of armor on me. There we go. That way I'm not completely exposed. I, th yeah, I think I saw a desert over here. We could go look for a sand village and not get blown up by this creeper. And get stuck. Oh, I thought I thought I was stuck in here. And the creeper is following me. Run! Oh gosh. Uh, looks like it's turning day, but I need to get away from these guys, basically, if I want to survive. I'm gonna run through the this desert a little bit, looking for a village or sand temple or something. It doesn't look like the desert goes very long though, so I might have to end up building a house. These mobs are pesky. Thank goodness it's turning day and they all burn, besides creepers and spiders. But I should be able to deal with spiders if anyway. The creepers are will be kind of a problem, but is this a cave? Did I find my house? Nope, it's not a cave. I guess I could turn this into a house, but I I think it'd be better if I had like an above ground house, not in a cave. Here's what I always like to do. 
break everything. Oh, I thought there was more floating blocks in there. There is. Fall. There we go. I like making it fall. It kind of looks cool. And I also like to see what would be covered up af like after I go explore. Or if after I go explore the cave or whatever it is. Like if it's gravel or sand or whatever is floating. I like to go back and hit a block and make it all fall. I think that's kind of cool. Okay, so I, th I think we're just going to go fi try to find a spot that would be pretty good to sit and make a little house. I think I'm going to make it on that island over there. Like, I think it's just going to be like a small dirt hut. Or not dirt, but like wood. Or actually, I'm going to make a sandstone house. Like, the walls are going to be sand, but I'm what the roof's going to be sandstone. That way, you know, it doesn't fall and kill me every time I try to place sand. So it's sandstone. I think if it's going to be a sandstone slash sand house on a sand, on a little sand island, I think that'd look pretty good. I might eventually ch move to a different location or change the way the house looks, but for now, for this time being, I think sandstone house would be pretty cool. Oop. Fifteen. It'll probably take a little bit more. Oh, here we go. There's a lot here. This should be the last piece right here. Then I'll build myself out of here. Maybe. There we go. And go make my house on that little island. I think I'm just gonna probably make like a little square type thing. I'm debating whether I should make like a hut or start to make a bigger house or what I should do. I think I'm going to make like a squarish. It's gonna be kind of roomy. But it's gonna be like a square house. Like a box. I think that'd look pretty good, but I might need to go mine more sand. Maybe more sandstone to do that. What I'll do is I'll use the sand and sandstone I have, and then I'll s stop when I run out. So let's make the walls of the sand. And I'm going to add corners. I like corners. And then any dirt or something inside of our house, we're going to replace with sand so it looks better. And I kind of want it cut to come out more over here. Yeah, I'm going to need more sand. That might, that should be enough. I'm going to start going over here now. Yeah, I'm going to need a lot more sand. Put doors there. Let's go up. And now I'm going to mine more sand. Be right back. Okay, so I went and mined a stack of sand. My shovel broke on about like 62. So I, I mined three. I mined two, pe two or three pieces of sand with my fist. I'm not sure if this is going to be enough. I'm just going to make two layers for now. But, like, enough for, for a jumping, for a room to jump in there. So, like, three blocks tall. I might not put, like, the edges around the roof. That way, it will be easier to do that. But... Sandstone there. Then I'll get back up there. Yeah, that was not enough. But I'll make do what I have and go from there. Actually, I might be able to mine some sand up from behind the house. So this is actually going to be pretty close. I'm off by one. 
wow. I guess it's just one protruding piece of sand. That I could just put should be able to place through here. Or completely miss. <laughs> there we go. Now I can put on roof. I might actually need more sandstone. Hey, maybe I'll be one off like I had like I was in the sand. That would stink. I might have to go back all the all the way back over there to get sandstone. When I should have just mined it while I was there. Yep. Just as I thought. Well, I might as well light light it up a little bit. Place my crafting table and it's still dark in here when you're cold in these corners. That should be over here. There we go. I'll make a new shovel. And replace this stuff down here. And I'm going to go mine some more sandstone now. I get to s swim all the way back over there. Actually, I want to make a boat. That's going to be helpful because if we're going to live on this island, we are no doubt going to need a boat. We're going to need another piece of wool. I guess I could just kill spiders and get string and make some wool. Which boat? Yeah, there's the boat. I was going to say. It's probably under the transport part, isn't it? But as soon as we finish this house, we're probably going to end up... We're probably going to finish this. Probably going to finish it out. And then... Yeah, basically. <laughs> we're just going to finish it up. Dang it! I'm never really good at actually landing the boat. I always break it. I really like, I would really like if they made it so boats wouldn't break. Like, like impact would still break it, but not, but it has to be quite a l big impact. It's not so fragile. That would make it a lot easier. That way, your boat didn't always break on you while you're trying to skid around. And you run into a wall or something of, of the other sort. Okay, so 12. I'm not sure if that will be enough. I'm hoping that'd be no that's going to be enough, but I think you can see the house from here. It looks like a giant sand square, which is what it is. Twelve isn't enough, I'm just going to leave it a hole in my roof. If we're like one off, I might leave a spot for a ladder or something later on, but you never know what could happen. For all I know, there could be a creeper in there right now just waiting to blow up my whole house. That would stink. I should also try to stop crashing my boats so much. And that way I can keep one boat on this island. Or just have a, like a chest full of them for every time I break my boat. Okay, no. no let's hope for the best. Oh yeah, that's going to be enough. I didn't realize it was such a small hole. Let's throw some junk into this chest. That I don't need right now. Including the sand and sandstone. Put the charcoal in there, the wool in there, make some doors, and I'll probably end it there. And here we go. I'll light up the island a little bit. Place some torches around here. There we go. That way mobs can't directly spawn onto the island give us a bad time in general because that would stink for uh, like a creeper to spawn outside and then we walk out the door and get exploded but there you go guys we made our house it looks kind of funky especially actually I should be able to put sand there since the doors 
would be holding it up, shouldn't they? The doors would be holding the sand up. Oh, yeah. See? Sweet. Now it doesn't look so funky. Now it just looks like it's sand. It looks like I lost a piece of sandstone, too. Or it's over there. Alright, there we go. So, we made our first house. Blocky. We'll probably end up keeping with this, but, like, expanding or, so or something. We're gonna have to make artificial islands or something like that. We can make, like, a chest island or something out there. I think that'd be kind of pretty interesting. But, that's our house for now. So, yeah. This is our house in Mystic Bali. And I'll see you next time on the Lava Pool MC. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.